In 2012, we had this amazing opportunity to go on a research vessel called the RV Falkor. It's related not to an institute called the Schmidt Ocean Institute. The RV Falkor has this amazing multi-beam system which, which image objects on the seafloor. We went offshore Corpus Christi, where about 50 miles offshore, we have a series of dead reefs, drowned reefs at minus 60 meters. We went to image these and we found you know, some very interesting features on this reef. We saw a series of staircase on this drowned reef. We imaged more than one, we imaged about 10 of them, and this staircase morphology was common to all of these reefs. The way that we can explain this, we know that this reef grew during you know, the melting of the ice sheets at the end of the glaciation, and um, are related to sea level. And what we see in most of these studies is that they just project the sea level rise to be gradual, which is not the case, and that is exactly what our study is showing, that the sea level rise probably occurred in punctuated sea level rise events, and this can have a major impact on future sea level rise predictions. So why you know, would that be important you not know, to try to estimate how fast sea level would be rising in the future, in particular you know, during a very short interval of time? Well, half a billion people you know, lived in these very coastal areas, you know, a few meters above sea level. Imagine in, if in 50 years, in maybe 100 years, suddenly sea level goes up by one or two meters, all this population will have to be moved, they would have to migrate in a higher ground. 